Okay, so here's my PDF file of my catalog, and I could leave it in this format and save it on my desktop if I like. Depending upon the version of Acrobat you have and how you downloaded, you might be able to search by keyword here. Let's see if that works. Yep, it did. So let's try to zoom in here. So I picked the word rabbit. So every time it finds the word rabbit uh, in the file, then, then that'll come up. Uh, let's try another common word, hearts. And it'll go to the next place that there's hearts. You can see that there. And there must be, there it is again. So anytime that word is on there, if you have a searchable PDF, and depending upon how you distill it, then you could do that. Um, but I'm going to go here back to page one. Let's say I was on the very last page of my PDF. Put one in there. I'm going to pick File, Print, and I'm going to pick my HP printer here. And I'm going to pick pages three and four. I'm going to go to Properties, and I just want a fast draft. I don't want to use a lot of ink for this, and my source is uh, the upper tray. My paper type actually is I have some matte photo paper, which is a lightweight cardstock. And um, let's see, finishing. I want to do two pages per sheet, so that's going to that's going to yield um, more information on one sheet of paper, and then I can cut that out. And uh, so now I'm going to pick OK. And it's going to process the file. And I'm going to pause while it prints so you can hear my printer engage. OK, I've gone ahead and opened up a RoboMaster new template. And I wanted to show you my library. So here it is. And they're sorted right now alphabetically, too, with a small view of icons. You can also go to large, which is actually what I do because my eyes aren't that great. Now, let's say we wanted to go out and buy a new image. So I usually go to New Releases, and um, it's going to open them up. I'm, I'm live on the internet right now, and I'm also recording, so my computer's running a little bit more slowly than normal. But um, here are all the new images that were most recently released. So let's say that I really like this one. I'm going to add it to my cart, and let's see which other ones I really like. Um, I like all of these. The laundry line is pretty cute, too. And these are some, some print and cut. So I think I'm going to add those and the Easter basket and the Happy Easter. And you can see because I'm logged in, it shows you which ones I already own. So I'm going to go up here, I'm going to go to Cart, Arrow Down, and because I have an unlimited account right now, it says free, so I'm going to pick Checkout. I'm going to type in my password here, and it shows you down here that it's um, downloading the files. You might not be able to see that because of this little status box. and Let's see, if we type in one of the new ones that I just added, there it is. There's my laundry line, and that's placing it into the Quick Cuts software. So now that those have been added, I'm going to go back out to that folder, and we'll take a look at that.